If you follow Depp and Heard in Virginia, you probably know the news is pretty much totally settled down. We've got Johnny doing things, obviously, but as far as Amber, she's in Spain calling paparazzis and things like that. However, on social media, there's still stuff going on pretty much every day. This here is from 15 hours ago from Karen Jam, and she says, Why the heck was Amber wearing glasses when she didn't need them? What was she trying to prove? And you know what? Karen's got 8,500 views on this from a day ago. But this person solo, who's probably an Amber fan, says, I feel like you guys are scraping the bottom. It looks desperate. Let's hold that thought. Obviously, there's going to be different motives for different people, but let's stick with people like Karen and people on social media who don't have platform and they're not getting ad revenue for it. Okay, I clipped it out a little bit bigger there. I'm not sure why this person included this picture from Amber's Apple ad advertisement, but okay. And yet she picks and chooses when to wear them to read. All from years ago, laugh out loud. I talk about this quite a bit. From years ago doesn't say much. If you look at politics, people are talking about things politicians said from decades ago, from years ago. If you look at huge cases like the OJ case, Michael Jackson, things like that, people talk about things that are decades old. So this doesn't really mean so much when you say from years ago. There's a lot on the net that comes back up from years ago. So I don't really accept that one. She couldn't see a thing through them. Amber fakes needing glasses. Once again, of course, old news, but some Johnny fans want to talk about it. I got no problem with that. And like I said, Karen and these Twitter users and things like that, they're not making ad revenue. They're not building a following really off of it. They just want to discuss it. Oh, look, no glasses for reading. So people, you know, pointed things out. You know she brought those in after Dr. Curry, right? People have glasses with clear lenses because they think they look cool. Also, JD wears glasses. Yeah, I think that's what Johnny fans were getting at. They're not real reading glasses. They just make her look intelligent. All right, kind of easy to figure out. And this person gives some more details. Press phobia, I think it's called. The inability to focus on things close up. It's something that happens with age. I think I got it, but I could read this still. All right. And the person says Amber's too young to need them. But Johnny Depp wouldn't need them. You know, he's a little older than her. That makes sense. And here, this person says your abuser was looking like the desperate one. And Fun says desperate for what? But I got to throw that question back at Fun because it's a good question. So what would a Johnny user who's got like 100 followers be desperate for? Desperate for attention? Desperate to prove Amber wrong when she's been proven wrong over the last four or five years in court, there's nothing to be desperate for. So it's just people who want to keep the facts circulating out there. That's basically what it is. It's not really about getting old, getting new. What's the date on this? Is it expired? No, it's just part of history now. And Sanja obviously agrees. She's faking, show for all. She faked it on the stand. Obviously, we're in agreement. But Laura Slade here says... These people are unemployed. They have nothing to do without making ridiculous theories about Amber. Also, how did they know that she didn't need reading glasses? All right, let's break that down. These people are unemployed. They have nothing to do without making ridiculous theories about Amber. As if that takes hours out of your day. I mean, I'm making a video here, but it's only going to take about 50 minutes out of my day. So for them, once again, let's think critical. They open X, they respond to the post. They close their phone. It takes them about, I don't know, a minute to do this. Even if it's consistent, that's just like, you know, a quick minute every day opening your phone and closing it. It doesn't mean much. It doesn't say much. They could be employed and on a cigarette break. Hopefully, you know, they don't smoke, but it's a good example because that's like five minutes. Or on a bathroom break. Okay. They go in the bathroom. They're looking at their phone. They respond to the post. So, it's a bad point, and it doesn't take much time. Even for the people who do take time for it, it doesn't take that much time. And of course, Lori points out that Amber fans do the same thing, which they do. That's about it. Let me know what you think down below. Are Johnny fans desperate? I'm going to say no. Before I go, shout out to 
So Brinkle Dinkle, thank you so much for this comment super chat. It's appreciated. And Eileen, who's a new member on the channel. I couldn't see Eileen's actual screen name because I focus on the studio. I'm in the studio all the time. But thank you so much. You know who you are. If you're not subscribed here, consider it. If you don't, I'll be sad, but I'll get over it. See you next time.